All right, there are some heated debates causing quite a stir on social media, so it's time to check out why the Internet's divided. Okay, and here to break it all down for us is today's digital editorial director, Ariana Davis. Hi, Ariana. Hi. Hi. All right, so what is the Internet divided on? Lots of stuff. Okay. The first one they're really fired up about is a woman named Tammy Nelson posted on TikTok, and she said that, a woman behind her asked if she would switch her airplane seat. So Tammy had a window seat, okay. and this mom was traveling with her two kids and asked if she would switch to a middle seat so she could sit with her kids. Tammy said no. She said, I have a window seat. I selected the seat in advance. I'm not moving. People are very fired up because a lot of people are arguing, hey, it's really difficult to travel with kids. Yeah. You could be considerate, while others are like, Sunny Anderson even from the Food Network commented <laughs> on our Instagram, and she, she was like, mm, I'm definitely going to be sticking to my window seat because I have anxiety. I picked this seat to the the point where I will maybe not even pick a flight if I don't get a window seat. Oh, so wow. she, was, she feels very strongly. You shouldn't have to give it up. Well, but we should point out the, the children are 10 and 11, right? 11 and 15. 11 and 15. Yeah, so they're not agent. young kids. Yeah, they the weren't other... little ones. Yeah. Yeah. So what would you? What do you guys think? Uh, I think, well, I have a 10-year-old, mm -hmm. and she likes to sit by herself with her sister, yeah. and I've worked really hard to where she'll have good behavior yeah. mm -hmm. to do so. You know what yeah. I mean? So I feel like if it's, I think if the kid is seven and under, yeah, you, you got to switch. switch. I think there are times to switch. I do think that it's probably okay, unless there's some uh, something else we don't know to the story. Like well, she needed true. to sit next to him for whatever reason. That's yeah. true. But and yeah. I do think you sometimes yeah. want to sit yeah. next to them for fun. Yeah. And But that isn't the way the cookie crumbles. That's, and sometimes you don't get what you want. What did the internet say? Like, So 81% of people said they feel you shouldn't have to switch you your seat. You should not. Which, yeah, which I'm kind yeah. of in that camp. I think you yeah. can select your seat in advance. If I got yeah. my window seat, if I took the time, then I get yeah. it. But okay. you also want to be considerate of Totally. Yeah, Tell us totally. our next one, girl. This so is fun. The, the next one that people are divided about is there's a Reddit user who posted that he suggested to his date that they go on a date to go get ice cream. And she basically responded, thanks, but no thanks. I will not. I, I feel like this date feels like the bare minimum. I'm not interested in going out for ice cream for a date. I don't want to waste either of our time. I feel like we're on a different vibe. So everybody has been up in arms about mm -hmm. that. A lot of people have been saying, what's wrong with an ice cream date? It's really sweet. Like, it's a little bit of whimsy. And then other people have been saying, listen, if she says that's the bare minimum and that's not what is her standard then like mm -hmm. more power to her so I'm very curious what y'all think about this one I mean I actually think it's fine I think that after you have ice cream you go for a walk totally. and you go to the park I think the date isn't like let's go get ice cream but if if what defines a good date for you is how much are you spending on me yeah then probably Maybe that's not the right guy for her. Totally. You know, maybe there's somebody else. I right. actually think an ice cream date is kind of romantic. Yeah. Me too. Because it reminds cool. you yeah. of being young again and yes. playful. Yeah. And, yes. But I also think, you know what? Stick to your guns. If you don't want to go out yeah. on with them, yeah. don't go out. A lot of people pointed out Barack Obama took Michelle Obama before they were t they, they went on an ice cream date, and that's where they had their first kiss. So oh. worked for the she Obama. Could've, she could have married a president. Inter yeah, yeah exactly. Could have been the future What'd the president. internet say? Eighty-nine percent of people said ice cream dates are very sweet. Oh, so okay. yeah, I'm with them. All right, great fine job. Yeah, Thank that was so much yeah, fun. That was fun. Thank you. Happy All right. summer. All right. Oh, we have oh, one we more. Have one oh, more. I thought you said wrap. Okay. <laughs> okay. Here it is. Ready? The last one that everyone is talking yeah. about is: Should you wash your feet while you're in the shower? So not just taking a shower, but should you specifically oh, go get down to down your feet, there? get down there, and wash them? Oh no. This no. is an ongoing debate. No. We still don't even have our votes in for this one because people are still Okay, voting, here's the thing. Think? So bending over to wash your feet? <laughs> yes. Okay, I just feel like everything's rolling on down that way anyway. I mean, I agree. getting clean I agree 100%. The dial suds is, no, 100%. No, but may I ask you, do you bend down there to shave your legs? Yeah, well, no, I put my leg up on the landing. Oh, yeah. No. The, you know, right? Yeah, so you could put your leg up there and scrub those little <laughs> no, feet. No, but you wouldn't. This is you where, know I wouldn't. Of course, I got a different By the way, if we are I differ with you, ladies. I'm down there scrubbing in between the toes, like Wait, getting you it off. Are? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Why? I just feel like there's a lot happening down there. It's just like somebody I, posted yeah. a map of of where people wash, and yes, it's they do. always the same places. What? Here, armpits. Here, and your feet. Really? And you're like, your but feet? Do you don't even. I have a question. Do you even go below the knee when you're washing? No. Wow, I'm learning a lot today. But water <laughs> splashes there, and I shave my legs almost yeah. every day. A little soap, a little scrub. I don't know. That's okay. Just okay. All right. If you want to weigh in on these viral <laughs> debates, go to, to our today.com uh, slash poll.